In this segment, we're going to be talking about some of the specific characteristics of the xylophone and some of the mallets that we're going to use on this instrument. In, with xylophones, the bars are made out of rosewood or synthetic. The mallet selection is very important. With any keyboard percussion instrument, you want to have a wide range of different mallets to choose from so that you can get as many different colors and sounds as possible. With any mallet selection on any keyboard instrument, you want to make sure that the mallet that you're using is not harder than the instrument that you're playing. The characteristic sound of the xylophone is generally very bright and cutting. So a great choice for a mallet is anything made out of a poly material. The M133 is a great general mallet on the xylophone. However, just like with any other instrument, the xylophone is capable of a wide range of different sound tonal colors. So, if the M133 is a little bit too bright for the music you're playing, you may want to try something softer. The M130 is an example of a mallet which is able to get a, a warmer sound, especially in the low end of the instrument. But, a softer mallet may not be able to speak the way that you need it to in the higher register of the instrument. Here how the sound is a little bit dead and for this register you're definitely going to need a mallet that's brighter. If you need a mallet that's more bright and cutting, use something harder. The M140 is a mallet that's made out of a hard plastic so it can get a really bright sound, especially in the higher end of the instrument. With a mallet that's this hard, you want to be very careful that you're not overplaying because there's a chance that you might damage the instrument, especially in the lower register. So we've talked about three great selections of mallets that can be played on the xylophone. A general, a soft, and a hard. Now, there's any number of other mallets that you could choose from, and each mallet gets a different sound and a different characteristic out of the instrument. So the most important thing to remember is to choose the mallet that gets the sound that you want for the music that you're playing.